to show you how to put together a floor display that we use either for our firepower floor display program or for our helmet floor display program. First, you'll have a box that comes flat like this that contains the entire floor display corrugated to display. We can cut it open with a knife, which I've already done for ease. So you cut it open at each end, each end, and then down the middle carefully, not to cut the inside. Everything is bagged. I've already taken the base out of the bag here for ease. This is how it comes flattened. As you can see, the bag is already in there with the shelves and the header. We'll take this over to here, give you an idea, and I will put the base together. Is step one. First thing you will do is you'll see there's two sides. The top part is already folded over. We'll go ahead and fold that up, as you see here. Then you can slowly kind of open it up, and it will square itself out in a rectangle shape. On the bottom, however, there are a few tabs. We're going to want to bend these down, and it'll help it keep its shape and keep it upright for us as we work. Okay. Then we'll take this first flap here, we're going to bend in the ends, and fold this over. This will be the base of our first shelf, or where our first shelf rests, like so. Then we have these two tabs, as well as inner tabs inside of it. Okay, we're going to separate those just a little bit, so they pop through, and can bend either way. And then you're going to want to make a fold with these so they come in like so. We will use these tabs to secure the shelves later, and you'll do the same thing up here. And this will lead us to our second step, which will be putting these shelves together, which there are three. Two, where we're going to put together three shelves, the three-tiered design. Here's a shelf I already took out of the bag. We'll put it up right here on the table and we'll put it together. I'll put the other shelves to the side for now. First thing we'll do is open it up all the way because it comes folded for ease. And the next thing you do then is pull up the back side here. You're going to have this squared front. This is the front. The angled side is the back. Okay. There's tabs here. You're going to want to fold in on each side gently and then you pull this up. Okay. And also in doing so, you will fold this little tab and one on this side as well. And at that time, you can pull this piece up, push this tab right into there, which will help keep everything secure. And do the same thing to this side. Help keep everything secure. Okay. At this time, we'll also then fold over this side tab. You can see it's already kind of scored. These little tabs right here will go right into these slots. We'll do the same thing on this side. Right into these slots, right into these slots. So now your shelf is starting to come together. You have your front tabs only to work with now. Take this one loose piece, bend it out, and bend it back in. Do the same over here. Then you have only your front panel, which will fold two times. You fold it once, just to get it kind of broken in. And then you'll take that, and then fold it once over the tabs, so that it goes completely over and back into itself, where it is secured down here. You then will repeat this two more times, to have three complete shelves. And it'll take us to our next and final step. Step, which is we're going to secure the shelves, the three tiered shelves, to the, the steps we already built here for the base. All the shelves are the same and interchangeable. You put the first one on, it has tabs in the back. These little tabs right here are going to end up coming from the back, through here, and to the front. And I'll show you how we do that. We pop them through. Bend over the little eared tabs and pull it through. Do the same on this side. Starting at the outside slot, coming to the inner and smaller slot.
Repeat that same step for this tier here. There's one already done. I'll go ahead and do it for the second shelf here. You go ahead and bring it through the back here. And you want to use your hands on both sides to help pull it through and make it easy. Also prevents any damage. Do that to each side. on this step for both this shelf and this shelf, and on the third shelf, and all the shelves are interchangeable, we'll bring it up through the bottom slots. Like you see here, then you bend, and you dip it back down through. Let's see if we can get a good picture of that. And this was how it would be finished. We put the header card right on at the end with whichever logoed header card we've sent you, one for firepower or the one for the helmets. And that is the final step to completing the floor display. At least we do put on the header card which is fully logoed with either firepower or our helmet designs. And you put that right on the top here. I put in tabs in the back and one big tab in front.